You guys asked for it. I am gonna share, actually my dad's gonna help me share how to do a shrimp boil. So we are at the lake, my family, we're here for about four days and on my meal plan, I said that we were doing a shrimp boil. This is going to be very vlog style. If you guys don't follow my vlog channel, you know I, told, I definitely look a little bit more put together than this, but all day at the lake, all natural it is. So we actually started the shrimp boil. It does take longer than I remember it taking, but that's because I've never sat and watched it or anything like that. So I'm gonna go over with the help of my dad since I never do it, this is totally my dad's thing, how to do a shrimp boil. All right, dad, what you got going right here? So what we have going is basically we take what a lot of people traditionally use for a turkey fryer. And we're using the same pot that you would use for a turkey fryer, but uh, again, all we're doing is we've got water in there that's coming to a boil. And I go ahead and put the seasoning in there so it gets really mixed up good when the water starts to boil. It smells good. And uh, so that's just a uh, seasoning package. Is it Old Bay? It's Old Bay seasoning that's in there. Then another package that you see in there that has a whole bunch of other spices. This one right here. Yep. And that floats around in there and again it seasons the water. And to heat it up he's using a propane tank. Yep. Again, it's like you would do a turkey fryer. You know, bring and and it takes a while, right? It takes a while to get the water start to boil. Then once the water is boiling, then I have another basket that goes inside of that. And we'll start with the potatoes first, because they take the longest. So we'll let, put the potatoes in there, and once they start coming to the top of the boiling water, that means that they're about done. <laughs> and then we'll put the sausage in on top of that. And then after that boils for a little bit, then I'll put the corn in. And the corn is pre-cut into about, I think it's probably about three or four inch um, length cuts. Put that in there, let that come to a boil again. And then once it comes to a boil, for the last time, then we'll put the shrimp on top. Because the, the shrimp doesn't shrimp take... Takes about three to four minutes. Mm -hmm. And uh, what I'll usually do is, is once again, once the water starts really boiling really hard and the shrimp are coming to the top, every once in a while I'll just pull one out until I like the texture of the shrimp. And once I like the texture, then we just pull it off and say it's done. All right. Pour it into some big aluminum pans like a, like a turkey type baster. Mm -hmm. We'll just drain it a little bit and just pour it all in there then everybody just grab it. It's fin for yourself, yep. So we'll show you guys once we get that basket in and all that good stuff. And of course there is beer involved. <laughs> <laughs> all right, water is boiling and my dad is bringing over the new potatoes. New potatoes. You guys, you and you can cook however many you want, right? It just depends right. on how many people you're feeding. Yeah. So this is what, two bags? Three bags. Three bags of new potatoes. And it's just going into the pot. And again. And we, we'll yeah. Just wait until it starts boiling again and the potatoes start coming to the top. Yeah. We know the potatoes. Because, uh, yeah, and we're doing the potatoes first, obviously, because potatoes take longer to cook. So this will be in yep. steps. Okay, you guys, so while the potatoes are cooking, I thought I would go ahead and show you some of the ingredients so you can see what we got. So that was three bags of new potatoes. No idea what size they were or anything like that. Um, and then we're putting in these four packages of premium smoked sausage, mesquite. You can put in whatever kind of sausage you want. I'm just showing you again what we're using. So we've got four packages here. Um, we are doing corn, but that's probably still in the freezer. And then here's our shrimp, lots and lots of shrimp. All right. Back to a boil, so potatoes are cooking good. Oh, I can see them, yep, popping up. So now we're putting in the sausages. Putting in H-E-B mesquite Yep, I showed sausages. them. Yeah, I took it inside and I was like, all right, I didn't show you guys the potatoes, but here's the sausages. So just all four of those packages right into, make sure you get it right into the pot that's in there. You don't want them running out. All right, next up is the corn, and these are just frozen. 
little mini corn on the cobs. This is a bag of 48, I think I saw. 24. Oh, 24. 24. Don't listen to me, I lied. They're but, already mm, floating them. Huh? Yeah, they're floating, but they're gonna take a few minutes to cook. Mm, I really wish you guys could smell this. It smells good. It's hot though. You can really feel the heat coming off of it. All right, you guys, so this is everything except for the shrimp, and there's a little bit too much water in here. Like if he added the shrimp, it would, wouldn't would stay in this inner bucket. So after all of this is done, we'll take out the inner bucket, go ahead and pour this into a big pan, which I'll show you. That way this stuff can start cooling off, and then put the shrimp back in here and let the shrimp cook. So we will be back when we're ready to do all that stuff. All right, we are taking the food that we have in here out. Yeah. Oh yeah, here. Just in case. I'm gonna back up a little bit because you guys, this is really hot. Oh my gosh, dad, do not burn yourself. So look at all that food. It smells so good. It is plenty. We always have some leftovers. We don't always eat it all, I don't think. So. And then that's the pot or the pan that we're using. Oh, potato down! Two potatoes down! Another, another box? Yeah, if you would, grab the other tray. All right, had to get the other tray. Okay. So we got Let's all of our goodies the right table. there. And then putting the insert back in here and we're gonna get our shrimp and I'll show you guys. We're just gonna dump the shrimp in here and let that cook until it's done. And there goes the shrimp. And this is this is not peeled or anything. No, this is just straight it, up raw it, shrimp, no, right? Deveined. Oh, it's deveined. Okay. And now we're just gonna cook it until it gets a little pink. All right, shrimp is done. Nice and pink. And then same method, we're just gonna dump it in this pan here. All right, here is our setup. So we've got the shrimp. We've got some lemons, cocktail sauce, spray butter, extra seasoning in case you know you want more extra spiciness. And then in here we have the corn, potatoes, and sausage. And everybody is hungry. We got some bowls, some plates, some paper towels, and we are going to eat. All right, you guys. So dinner is ready. Just a quick little overview of how my dad puts together our shrimp boil. I don't have exact times, it's kind of different. You just have to watch your food and see what kind of texture and all that you want it. Um, and then just eat away. Thanks for hanging out with me today. I know this is definitely a little bit different than some of my other videos on this channel. This is definitely more relaxed and vlog style. I mean, I am sunburnt, you guys, and I put sunscreen on. So I'm gonna go inside, make my plate, get my kiddos plates, and we are going to enjoy the rest of our last vacation before school starts. If you like this video, give it a big thumbs up. If you are new to my channel, I would love for you to subscribe and join my family. With that, I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.